Hey everybody, and welcome back to more Amiibo Mage Adventures. I'm just out here, chilling in the, the wildlands, jumping. Uh, last time, we finally broke free of the that dank dark cave that we were trapped in under that single bedroom house. Uh, I think today we're just gonna we're just gonna try to beeline it for a river wood. See if we can get this show on the road, but we'll see see how well I do with that because obviously I get distracted very easily. Like right now, I see all those red dots on the map, and it makes me want to go. Um, see what they are? Um, not quite sure what that guy's doing right now. Whoa! What? What? I'm sorry. Whoa! What? What? All right. So that guy just didn't like the look of my face, I guess. I don't know where I that... You. Um... Okay. I... have never seen that happen before. Weird. I wonder if he lived at that house and he's just horrified of all the horrible violence I did to all his, his teammates. I'm sorry. Sorry, not sorry. What? Who's over here? Oh, hello. Oh, maybe that guy was trying to get me to come over there? Uh, no, I don't know. That was weird. Hello, sir. Gotta go! Ow. He doesn't seem very susceptible to my flame... my flame fingers. This <laughs> uh... Is this a fun way to battle in this game right now? Just kind of backing up and using fire till whatever thing attacking me is dies. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. Let's uh definitely beeline it for for the town. See if we can get some spells. If not there, then maybe we'll run to that main. Main Dragon Town, whatever that's called, White Run. Get some spells in there. Let's get the super dramatic battle music. I'm not seeing any of the things that uh, want to kill me. Sir, you you've just gotta. Yeah. You keep distracting me. Amiibo Mage does not put up with any shenanigans. All right. The music finally died down. That's, uh, I guess we handled that situation with unbelievable violence. Um, nope, there's a uh, bandit chief. Oh, hey, bandit chief. You've got really strong armor on, so my flame attacks probably aren't going to do that much damage to you. Um, wonder. If I get my spark on, is that gonna do any more or less damage to you? Let's see, wherever you are hiding right now. You be stuck on a rock? Ow! Not seem to be doing much damage. Uh, let's see if I have any. See if I have any mana potions right now. Resist magic. Looks like I'm completely out of healing potions, so I may have to resort to the old dagger attacks. I have four of them, so that's good. Oh, that was real hard to aim. And let's uh, some cheese. Maybe we can eat some cheese real fast so I don't kill myself. Definitely need that big potato. Got a ton of potatoes, rabbit haunches, uh, sacks of flour, 
Is that all right if I just throw this on the ground right now, rip it open and eat it while this guy is trying to chase me? Is that acceptable? Okay, I think we're good. Oh, he's, uh, he is not pleased. Yeah, this is a... Uh, I really don't like the first person stuff in this game. Oof, that hurt. I find it very hard to aim. I need all these haunches, get some flour in me. Uh, more potatoes. Oh, forgot about the grilled leeks. Yeah, let's do that. Get some apples. Uh, maybe I can hit you a couple more times and then finish you off with some flame surprise. Like this. Nope, that's not flames. That's flames. Oh, is that gonna do it? Yeah, look at that. I even broke her legs. I melted all the bones in her body, so she just kind of collapsed to the ground in a puddle. That's how true wizards do it. Uh, lots of lots of heavy steel dagger. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, please. All right, so there's some stuff we can get off these guys. Uh, yeah, so before we were so rudely interrupted, level up. Get my Magicka up. Let's keep boosting that. Let's take a look at the map. Okay, so we're kind of heading in the right direction. If we would not keep getting attacked by random bandits that hate me. Hate the look of my face. Let's see. Oh, I see some deer. Too bad I can't flame them. Get some more flowers. Uh, oof, my cat. I was gonna try try my hardest to edit all the cat meows out, but I might just have to leave them in and then <laughs> put in some type of graphic or something. Every time one of my cats feels the need to speak their mind. All right, so we found another cave, Helgen Keep. Where on the map am I right now? Uh, so, I was hoping that would, oh, is that where I, yeah, that's totally where I came out of. Doi. All right. So, it's like we're starting the game all over again. It's like we're living it for the first time. So, let's go down this road that they probably intended for us to follow the first time before we got lost for two hours. Uh, let's Loot some more flowers. Let's see. Um. Run in. How close are we? Not very close. So, yeah. I'm probably going to need to start thinking about some topics to talk about that are not Skyrim related. I forgot how kind of quiet this game can get when there's not too much happening. At least in the end game, uh, when you've unlocked a bunch of areas, you can kind of teleport there very quickly, so in the future that'll probably, probably save some time, but for now, uh, let's see, what's uh, What's going on? I officially beat all the DLC pack 2 for Zelda Breath of the Wild. That was pretty fun. I um, I think like a lot of people I was kind of, I wouldn't say disappointed, but kind of, I don't know, I guess disappointed that they say it was quote unquote story DLC, but didn't necessarily have too much to do with the story um, it had a lot to do just with character building 
for the kind of side characters of that game, which I do, I did like, I loved a lot, but yeah, I think it's kind of, kind of misleading to call it story DLC. Uh, definitely need the mage stone. Mage, those under the sign of the mage will learn all magic skills 20% faster. Um, yes, always. Ooh, that's me. I did that. That's that's what I'm looking for. Um, all right. Cool. Let's keep going. Uh, yeah. So it wasn't very story focused, but I loved it. I love any amount of time I can spend in that game. All the excuses, any excuse I can make to spend more time in that game. Um, I'm sure at some point I'll probably pull, make some videos of that game just to give me an excuse to play more of it. I may have mentioned it here before, but I have officially put in over 300 hours to that game, which is crazy. I don't ever really do that um, unless it's like an MMO. And even then, I haven't played one of those in a very long time. So a single player game, I don't believe I've come anywhere near that. I do love turn-based RPGs, and those are like can be very long games, but I'm sure I haven't gone over 200 hours with any of those games, probably. Uh-oh. Here comes some wolves. He was defying gravity. The gravity dog. Oh. Ooh, that fire hurts. Yeah. Roasted dog. I mean, roasted wolf. Sure we can turn that wolf pelt into something? Something useful? Uh, it is a little... A little kind of weird bouncing back and forth between Skyrim and um, Breath of the Wild. They're not... I mean, they are kind of similar games different control schemes and everything so there's a lot of stuff in this game that I feel like I want to interact with Breath of the Wild like every tree I'm kind of just like I wonder what's up there but unfortunately can't climb any trees there's no Korok seeds here that I know of at least it's disappointing this game could definitely benefit from more, from more Koroks Ooh, I see it. I see the town. Forget all these berries and stuff I can loot. I'm so close to the town. Uh, so yeah, here's our first, first challenge. Let's see if I can resist the urge to buy or sell anything. That's not a spell. Uh, it does help that apparently everybody is asleep right now, so... Uh, and I don't know if I said... I don't remember it was so long ago since I did that rules video, but I do think I'm going to allow myself to steal stuff. Um, I don't know, just because since I can't buy, which I feel like in a normal game is where I would get a lot of my... a lot of my supplies, I kind of just want to... I don't want this to drag out for super long. I just, you know, want to be able to go at a pretty fast pace here with the Amiibo, Amiibo Knight, so. Let's get our steel on. Yoink. This is going to be tough. Hopefully I can... I might not actually need any of that stuff, but we'll see. No, I should probably not make leather unless it's something that I actually need to make. Know what I mean? Just so I'm not carrying all that extra weight. Is it Bonehawk amulet? That's beautiful. I don't need leather. That is light armor, but eh. Light. Lights. There's a lot of light armor going on there. 
I forget what I have equipped right now. The Imperial stuff. Um, I'm definitely going to keep the magic robe and magic hood. Uh, let's see if I can make some better boots and bracers. So seven. So they both are seven. Boots and bracers. Let's see. Boots and bracers. Yeah, those are about one point difference. Hide. So let's see what I need for both of those. I need two leather, two leather strips, three leather, and four leather strips total. So let's go ahead and do that. Two wolf pelts. Could just use one of these. Actually, I might just yeah do that. I made a bunch of leather strips. We might be good. Should hopefully have enough to make the leather. Yeah. Make that, make that, and since we're here, let's see if I can boost that defense up at all. Yeah, I can. It needs leather. So, of course, I only have one. Up to nine. So, let's make... Now, I might just go ahead and make all the leather and then just craft everything that I can. Because I do... I think I am going to want to probably increase my crafting ability just so I can have better leather stuff or light armor stuff but I don't know we'll see let me look at the skill tree real fast see what I forget what all all there is where you at smithing so I basically don't need anything from this right side. So I was thinking I might need that because I can improve um, magical weapons and armor, increase increase the defense of all that stuff. So I'll probably need to get at least to that, I would think. Um, damn it, might be helpful to get this stuff but probably not I don't know if I'll do that much crafting to get it that high um, we'll see uh, improve so I need 60 so let's just get our craft on I forget which which of these is best to level with but let's do bracers and of course since I can't sell stuff we'll just deposit a little gift here for ye old blacksmith and drop all this other stuff that I can't use like that iron sword um, where's all my daggers definitely don't need four daggers probably only need one so I've got that steel dagger now I know I took that but I don't really think I need that and the rest of the swords I'll keep equipment James got favorited right now. Keep that so I can break it down. Drop those, drop those, drop those, drop all that. Oh no, I do need. Dang it. <laughs> totally just dropped all my equipment. Um, bracers. Boots. There we go. Fine boots. Whew. That was a close one. That would have been great if it like rolled into the ground or something. So, got the braces equipped, let's get the boots equipped, and then drop the rest of this stuff. Probably keep that. And yeah, I think, well, drop the fur boots. I think we're good. So let's um, maybe see if I can do a little sneak attack in here. Actually, it's probably more beneficial to break into the, ooh, cabbages to break into the general store over here. So I think there might be... Oh, what time is it? 10.41 p.m. So I guess everybody's not actually asleep yet. So maybe I'll just let, let the time pass a couple hours. Let it get a little darker. Let people have time to settle into bed. And then 
I can, uh, well, let's see. I'm gonna quick save real fast. See what's going on in here. I'm gonna assume he's probably still sitting at the counter, staring at me, wondering why I'm crab walking into his establishment, but. Oh. Oh, maybe it's because I need to do this quest thing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. Uh, we, are done we get it. You guys hate each other. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me your quest, goatee man. Robbers were only after one thing. The Riverwood Trader is everything you need. Oh, does he spell cells? I think I have a few old spell books laying about. Yeah, he does. One more, you'll have to go to the college. Give me your spells. Okay, whatever. Show me your... Give me your goods. Ooh, look at all these spells. Raise zombie. That sounds like something I need in my life. Oak flesh. Proves armor. 40 points for 60 seconds. That could be kind of nice, I guess. I'm rating by 40 and negates up to 40 points of spell damage. What? Fury... Creatures and people are level six, will attack anything nearby. That could be helpful too. Classic cold air, yes, definitely need that. Ice magic is what I'm looking for. Show path to current goal. Eh. Definitely need raid zombie. Um, Fury could be interesting. Might just buy that to see what happens. These, I don't know about because like increasing my armor sounds good but it only lasts for 60 seconds so that seems like it would be kind of obnoxious but you know I might just buy all of these just for the heck of it um, I don't think I can buy anything else from him so damn thieves what As if things weren't my sister Camilla or I will be happy. Yeah, 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 whatever. Maybe you're not. Yeah, I can. It got, whatever I, you need me to I do, just, I can do yes. it, I swear. Oh, did you need something? Um, I don't know. Did you give me a quest? Oh, did you need something? I don't know. Maybe you're You tell me. just about uh, yeah. An ornament, solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Shape of a dragon's claw. I know. Uh, yeah. An ornament. Solid gold. I could get the claw back. I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. Ooh. It's yours if you bring my claw back. All right, smell you later. I'm gonna go maybe get that claw, but I don't remember if I will. I probably will. Let's go ahead and use all those sweet spells I just got. I could probably drop that. Don't need your letter. Orange Clairvoyance, Frostbite, Fury, Lesser Ward, Oak Flesh, and Raise Zombies. What are you doing that for? What? What did I do? It's just littering. Whatever, man. Chill out. I'll be over here summoning the dead. Well, just wanted to get out of town real fast because I'm not too sure if the guards will frown upon <laughs> me raising the dead. Uh, so let's go ahead and favorite some of this stuff. I don't... You know, I'll just favorite all of it. And try it all out. See what happens. So, clairvoyance. Let's see what that does. Um... Whoa. We have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. I'm sorry? Lucan found the claw about a year what? after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. This way. What? What? Okay. Did I what? This way. What way? Did I tell you that I was gonna go do it right now? I don't I don't remember doing that. But um I guess we're apparently going on an adventure, so Try. I do like the way the frost hands look. Look up here. I like my spell. This is the bridge out of town. My spell mode. The mountain to the northwest leads okay. To Leak Falls Barrow. Okay. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll yeah. throw a fit if I take too long. 
<laughs> Such a child. Yeah, I don't think you really needed to walk me out here. I appreciate it, but um Don't even think about it. What? Listen, lady. Mara I don't know what you're thinking, I'm time. thinking, but I'm not thinking it. Well, it's a winding road up the mountain just ahead. Uh -huh. Once you get to the tower, head north. Bleak Falls Barrow should be just around the corner further up. Okay. Good luck. Lucan and I will be waiting for you back in the shop. Think I could pickpocket her? Think I can be quick enough to strike? Let's... Oh, somebody detected me, but... Who's watching me? You're not from around here. No, I'm not. There's two of us. I'm just checking out your belt. I like it. I like that belt. Um, <laughs> level in my sneak. Not sure what I did to do that, but I'll take it. Come on. Slow down, Camilla. I just want to loot your... I came here from the Imperial province you know what? Forget it. I don't want to pick your pockets anyways. So now that we're, we're alone again, let's see what the rest of these spells do. Got some ice fingers. Ooh, yeah. Okay, I'm liking, I'm liking that. I'm liking that. I can do double fury. Wah, wah, wah. Guess I only need one. Dang it. Felt like it took a lot of mana. I'll have to try that out on an actual monster. Um, lesser ward. Oh no, that's not even... Oh no. That's just like a shield. I thought it was like a... something that was on you at all times. Uh, yeah, definitely not gonna use that one. Oak flesh, that was the... I guess this is the buff. Oh, probably... This one probably takes a lot of mana. I wanna try to get... Look cool up here on the bridge. Casting spells. Wazzah! Okay. Um. I guess I glow a little bit. That's kind of cool, I guess. And. Let's try raise zombie. I wonder if I have to do this on an actual dead body. Yeah. I might have to do that on something that's dead. So, wah, wah. a lot of these I can't really use right now. Um, let's see. Let's go to my favorites. I don't think I'm going to use clairvoyance ever, probably. Uh, we'll have to try Fury out. Lesser Ward, I don't think I'm going to use. I'll try out Oak Flesh and the others as well. I'll try Frostbite for a while. Usually a uh, ice ice guy. So I don't think there was anything else in the town I necessarily wanted to do. I'm sure I'll have plenty of opportunities to come back here and steal stuff. So this town is not safe for right now. I do think there's a garden over here I could take some stuff out of. Whoa! Excuse you. Stump. Stump the dog. Well, I guess there was just a single flower. Somewhere over here there's a garden. But, uh, yeah. I think I might end the video here for right now before we go exploring. We successfully made it into Riverwood, so that's that's definitely more than I thought I was going to do. So, next time, I don't, I don't really know. Maybe we'll go talk to Gerder in Riverwood. And maybe we'll go do whatever that uh, claw quest is. I forget where that was telling me to go, but maybe we'll do that. I think that's where you get all the the beginning dragon stuff. And then after that, I guess we'll head to White Run, White Run and go from there. So yeah, we got a lot, lot of adventure ahead of us. The amiibo mage. And I know we haven't uh, summoned too many amiibo lately. Last time, I had that epic standoff with the bandit and was able to corner him with my treasure chest. So hopefully there'll be more of that. I'll try to think of some interesting ways I can use that in combat. 
But, uh, yeah. This has been the Amoeba Mage and her adventures. And we will check you all next time. Bye! Bye.